MJ Route22.com here with a retail rant. I don't know what you want to call it. They don't do things like they used to. I, I'm not sure uh, what the title of this series, but I think it's going to be called Retail Rant. Um, it's about Eastern Mountain Sports, EMS. We like what they sell. They have uh, cool st uh, sneakers and they have pretty decent uh, outdoor gear and uh, clothing and so on. And that is where the sort of love affair ends. Um, we're talking specifically about their coupons. They have coupons all the time that say save 40% on any one item or save 20% on any one item. Now keep in mind, this is what the coupon looks like and it says any one. Now I understand there's exclusions on some things, but the list of exclusions at EMS, again, we like the store and that's pretty much the, the coupon problem is, is, just, is just the beginning of this. Let me, let me read you uh, some of the exclusions here. And can you guess how many there are? <laughs> at the end of this, you'll see. So first of all, they'll start off with the, their exclusions with the basics, and we can understand these. Limit one coupon per customer. Offer valid on in-stock items only. Coupon may not be combined with other coupons. Two for one deals, daily deals, power deals, door busters, whatever that means. <laughs> By the way, door busters get me uh, cracked up because it's a bad thing when customers are lined up and they smash your door down to get some stupid flat panel TV that'll be obsolete or something stupid, but now they've turned it into a positive how? how do I, door but no, no door busters. Flash sales and clearance, which means prices that end in eight. Now that's sort of, I understand those nine exclusions. That makes sense. But let's just read the brands and other items that they don't uh, allow you to use the coupon for. Ready? Adidas. Anu. Ahnu. Arc. <laughs> Arcteryx. A6. Big Agnes. Birkenstock. Black Diamond. Brooks. Carhartt, Carolina, Chaco, Dansko, Fajal, Fajal, Fajal Raven, uh, whatever that is, Goal Zero, Hoka 1 1, Hydro Flask, Icebreaker, Innovate, oh, how clever is that, Keen, Cockatat, 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 I don't even know what that is. Cute. Leatherman, Levi's, Marmot, Merrill, my favorite sneakers, Native, Nemo, New Balance, Oakley, Obermeyer, Oboes, Alukai, Ufus, Osprey, Outdoor Research, we also like that brand, Prana, Rainbow, Reef, Royal Robins, Solomon, Sanuk, Scarpa, Smith, Sorrel, Sperry, Spikeball, Suncloud, Superfeet, Sun Sunto, Teva, The North Face, Thule, Timberland Pro, Toms, Under Armour, Vionic, Werner Paddles, Western Mountaineering, Yeti, and okay, all GPS enabled devices, action cameras, car rack systems and accessories, cargo boxes, fitness trackers and monitors, boats, bikes, um, stand up paddle boards, skis, bindings, boots, poles, and then, of course, so this is, I should have included this, but taxes, shipping and handling, gift cards, um, you can't return your item and get the discount, rentals, and EMS schools. So that makes 87, 87 exclusions to their 
to their coupon. I mean, I can understand a dozen of them, but they've exceeded that dozen by uh, by like it's like seven dozen items that uh, that they have exclusions on. At that point, how can they even say any one item? It should be 20% or 40% of the only one item in the store that's not restricted by these stupid exclusions. Um, and I know uh, Bed Bath & Beyond has a similar long list and Macy's and all these people, but, but they should be prohibited by some by either public consensus for us not to shop there anymore or, or by law. They say, hey, you know, you can't say any one item and put an asterisk and put this fine print. You need a freaking electron microscope to read the number of exclusions there are. It's ridiculous. Um, and by the way, EMS, we don't, I've had such negative shopping experiences there and I'm not saying all EMS employees are bad, but they all seem to be lazy. They seem to be anal retentive unhelpful um, and and just lackadaisical in general about uh, about their their work ethic and they, they just I don't know how the store stays clean maybe maybe some cleaning crew comes in and does it after after the close or uh, the store closes or maybe just no one shops there anymore because EMS seems to be some sort of money laundering operation I don't know they're owned by the same uh, company some venture cat they've sold They've traded hands like five times in the last 10 years. Some venture capitalist group now owns them and they filed for bankruptcy and, uh, in 2016 and Bob Stores is also the same company as, it's under the same uh, ownership as uh, Eastern Mountain Sports. But it's something very strange uh, about this, uh, this operation. Um, anyway, that's my retail rant for today. Uh, we went a little long, seven minutes, but uh, hopefully, uh, I can get more of these under my belt because I, I don't like I don't like exclusions and it's really annoying. Every time I've tried to use the coupon, I walked out of it. I'm like, screw this place. Alright. Have a nice week ahead.